So I went ahead and applied my skincare and I also primed my face with this Becca First Light Priming Filter. So I went ahead and I did those steps. I'm gonna be using my Revlon Color Stay, and this is in the color 150 Buff. And then I dampened my Wet n Wild makeup sponge before I started filming, so. But like I told you guys in my last Get Ready With Me from, I guess it was last week or it may have been two weeks ago, depending on when I'm posting this video. But I told you guys that I was going to film my Valentine's Day Get Ready With Me. So today is Valentine's Day and Josh and I were going to be going out to dinner tonight. It's this restaurant that's in Bargetown, Kentucky, and it's called The Rick House. And it's basically a steakhouse. I've eaten there once before, um, whenever my brother and his wife came into town for the holidays, they took, you know, Josh and I and mom and dad out to dinner there. So we had a really nice time whenever we went with them and the food was really, really good. And then we decided to make reservations for Valentine's Day. Like our reservations is at seven. So we're probably not gonna really do anything after that. We'll probably just come home and crash because I normally go to bed by like 8, 30, 9 o'clock. <laughs> I know, I'm like a grandma. Um, during the work week, I get up really early to work out. So I just get so tired so early. So yeah, we'll probably just go out to dinner and come back. We've had the day off today. Now I'm just gonna go in with my concealer and I'm just using the Revlon Candy Concealer but like I was saying, we took off today. Well, Josh is off on Fridays, but I took a vacation day today and we just like hung out. We didn't really do anything like super special during the day. Um, we were gonna go to the mall, but it was so, like the traffic was nuts over by the mall. Like I really wasn't, wasn't expecting it to be that crazy. So I guess people really do wait till the last minute to get stuff for Valentine's Day. Or maybe people were like us, didn't really have anything else to do. So they were just gonna go to the mall cause we were gonna go to the park today, but it has been so cold today. The low I think was 15 and I think the high today has only gotten like a little bit above freezing. So it's just been a really cold day. I don't even know if it's made it above freezing yeah, because right now it's 26 degrees outside, so we couldn't really go to the park. So we ended up, we went to Blaze Pizza, which is like a brick oven pizza place. The shopping center where Blaze Pizza is located, they have a world market there. And I just thought it would be cool to just like, you know, walk around and see the different stuff in there. They just have a bunch of different things in there. So we went in there and walk, like walked around, looked at a bunch of different things, like bought a, a few things. Um, and then, like I said, we were going to go to the mall, but it was just like the traffic was insane. It was just nuts. So we ended up just coming home and then we basically just relaxed all afternoon, which was super nice. So that's what we have done today. So for my brows, I'm just going to be using the Benefit Cabral and this is in shade four. And I still haven't been setting my foundation or concealer, so I'm just gonna skip that step today. And then I'm just gonna set my brows in place with the Benefit Gimme Brow, and this is in shade five. Just kind of wipe off the excess product. Okay, and then for my bronzing, contouring, I'm gonna be using my NYX blush in the color taupe. And 
and I'm applying this with my Morphe M437. I don't know if you can hear Josh. He's in the other room. And I'm just taking some more of this with my Wet n Wild Pack Me In powder brush. And I'm just blending this up around my hairline. And then I think I'm gonna skip a blush. We'll just see later once I get the rest of my makeup done if I wanna add a blush, but I'm not gonna put a blush on right now. Um, but I am going to do my highlight and I'm just going to use my Makeup Revolution. Sorry, that card sounds like an airplane. Um, I'm just going to use my Makeup Revolution Incandescent Palette and I'm going to use the Nude Shade. Like, I want to go with a look today that's a little bit more... I wouldn't say natural, but you know, like where I have nice highlighted skin and I'm going to wear false lashes today. So just like an emphasis on the lashes and then the a red lip. So just kind of more enhanced features. And then I guess I'm going to go ahead and do the eyes and I'm going to prime with my Urban Decay Primer Potion. And then I'm gonna zoom you guys in so you can see what I'm doing. I'm just gonna be using the Urban Decay Naked 2 palette and I'm gonna take some of T's and I'm gonna blend that in my crease just to create a little bit of a shadow. And then on my lid, I'm going to be using the shade, I think it's Booty Call. I'm just going to dust that on my lid. And then for my brow bone highlight, I'm just going to use my Milani Brow Fix Brow Kit in the highlight shade in this palette. And then I'm just going to use some of that in the inner corner of my eye. Then at the lash line, like I just want it to look extra smoky. I can't really decide if I want to use liquid liner or not, but I think first I'm just going to start out with a black eyeshadow and then I'll just see what it looks like and see if I want to make it darker and smokier. So I'm going to use blackout. And I'm just going to apply that at the lash line with an angled brush. And actually I do. Once I see that, I do want to use some liquid liner. So I'm going to go in with my Tardist Double Take Liner 
and I'm gonna use the liquid liner sad. I just want a more like intense, really black, closest to the lash line. I'm gonna do a wing and I might actually use my physician's formula eye booster for the wing. This is just getting really low on product. <laughs> So that's why I'm like reserving it for the wing, just cause it's easier for me to do the wing with this pin. Okay, and then once that liquid liner dries, I'll go back with the black shadow and smoke that out. Okay, now that that has dried, I'm just going back with that shadow. And just smoking the liner out. Also, this is a really good trick if you're not, like if you don't have a steady hand whenever you do your liquid liner, um, cause it'll kinda hide any bumps or like mess ups that you have with your, sorry about that, my camera totally cut out cause my battery died. I did not do a good job of remembering to charge my battery, so um, yeah. <laughs> But anyhow, I, what I was trying to say is if you're not good with doing your liquid liner, that little trick of using shadow to kind of smudge it out hides any mess ups. So now I'm going to go ahead and apply my mascara and some false lashes. And I'm debating between the ones that I wore last time. These are the Kiss Flirty Lashes or these Alter Ego Lashes in Celeb. So I think I might wear these. So we'll just see once I like get them placed and everything. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do my mascara first. And I'm gonna use this Grande Drama mascara, which I've really been loving this mascara. I got a little sample um, back at Christmas time uh, during the Sephora VIB sale, like the VIB Rouge. I ordered a gift set that had this little half size mascara and some more of the grande lash um so yeah i've really been enjoying this it reminds me a lot of like the Too faced better than sex mascara or the covergirl exhibitionist which is one of my favorite mascaras so it just does a really good job of giving your lashes fullness and it just makes your lashes look thicker. And the formula of this mascara also has some of the same ingredients as the Grande Lash MD, like the Lash Growth Serum. So this just helps to, you know, like condition your lashes and help them to grow a little bit longer, like the serum. I mean, I would recommend using the serum if you wanna get like the full length, like to grow your lashes long. But this just kind of helps to protect the lashes. So I'm just going to do a little bit of that. And then I'm going to apply the false lashes and come back. So I went ahead and got the false lashes on. And I ended up using the Celeb by Alter Ego. So I really like these. They just look so pretty. Um, so now the last step to this look is the lips and I was debating on which red lipstick that I wanted to wear but I think I'm going to go with one of my favorites and this is the Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink in the color Ruler 
and it's not like a super bright red it's more subdued but I really like this because it's super wearable on me sometimes really bright red lips almost look too much because I'm really fair so this one doesn't look too like intense and this stuff will last through eating and drinking and since we're going out to dinner I want something to last so I'm gonna go ahead and apply this and then after I apply this, I'll put my dress on and show you guys what my outfit is going to be for tonight. And then before I put my dress on, let me zoom out a little bit. Ooh. I want to go ahead and mist my face with makeup setting spray just to ensure that my makeup is going to last. Just to make sure that my makeup is going to last and just to tone down some of the powder on my face. So I'm just using my Urban Decay All Nighter. Okay, so <laughs> this is my dress that I'm wearing tonight and I'll link it down below in case you're curious about it but I just think this dress is so beautiful and really sexy for Valentine's Day the only thing is it's very cold out <laughs> so I'm gonna have to wear like my big like winter coat like my nice winter coat over this um, but yeah I just love 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 this dress I think it's so beautiful for Valentine's Day But I hope that you guys did enjoy this little get ready with me. Josh and I are literally getting ready to leave. He's heating up the car. So I'm really looking forward tonight. Thank you guys so much for watching today. Let me know down in the comments what videos you would like to see from me. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.